rain. We got another one that bites the dust. We got another one that just fell for the bait. Man, this bitch that called my phone, man. Damn, bro, why you playing with a nigga? Hey, this on God, don't let me wake up tomorrow on line. Well, he will he will lie. He this nigga just offset, just called my phone. Bro, why you playing with a nigga, bro? Da -da -da -da. Hey man, the truth hurt. You should have been on the internet with your business, my boy. Don't get mad because I'm posting shit on the internet now. But I'm speaking the truth. Now you mad at me. Don't go to call my phone, whole ass nigga. We ain't gonna do that, Tinder man. We ain't gonna do that. Cause I you know what I'm saying? Don't get mad cause I smacked one of your baby mama and I and I tried to fuck. I ain't gonna say fuck and take that back because ain't no disrespect to Cardi, but I really would just let her know, man, you need a real nigga in your life. Why you letting a nigga drag you through the mud? Like, don't go for that, baby. You feel what I'm saying? That's how I came in a deal. And you cop block, cause she went. You know what I'm saying? You cop block. Why you tell the but don't Then it bitch have nerve to say, bro, I don't even know you. But put this on your kids, boy. Put this on, on your kid, you don't know me. When I first just when I first started talking to Shia, my boy. But you used to pillow talk, you used to throw salt and say all type of sucker sideways ass shit. But you been knowing me too long way them. You been knowing me. And we ain't gonna speak on the street. And, and the other shit, nowhere going on, boy. When a nigga took your shit. In two miles, take a slight When a nigga right took your shit in my hood. To nigga robbed your bitch in my hood. Huh? Talk about that, buddy. Put that on your kids online, nigga. Upload that and talk about that, nigga. Put it on your kids, nigga. Put it on your soul, nigga. That I'm lying, nigga. Nigga, who handled the business for you, goofy? But you don't know me? That's why you was in your feelings when I with baby mom. I didn't know she was your baby mom because you didn't claim she was your baby mom. You didn't claim your child. Somebody please get a man some attention, some clout, whatever it is that he's seeking because I guess I guess because Woody paying his ass does he trying to find any relevance that he can. Somebody please give him some paper. Give him a job. Get that bitch a job. Put, a, put that bitch up in a warehouse somewhere. Got them. Do something, bitch. Do something other than talk about other people. How you want to talk about who or who pee or who tender, bitch? But you you speak on the next man relationship. The fuck? You're a chase. You're, you just want attention, baby. That man not going to give you no attention. That bitch not going to give you no attention. You ain't got no paper. You don't got no money, baby. No, you you bought me one bag the entire time that, that we was together, bitch. And I had to go in with you. You was mad that I was even trying to get you to get it from me. I had to put 500 on it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. That, that shit sound crazy, right? Like, like, you running the six figures, but I can't get you to buy me a $1,500 bag, bitch, and I just spent 20 plus racks on your attorney to, to save you from doing 30 years in jail. Ah, <laughs> uh, but you think you... To that chat We gotta call a spade a spade That shit was so lame Why sell Mondo He finna troll his way into a bag Let's be honest The nigga trying to start a rap career Or he been rapping But he really trying to blow up And you know Get everybody on his coattail But that shit not working bro We gotta be honest with him Like once he clout chased off the, you know, thug trial, we can't say he fully clout chased because he was, you know, he wide sale and he was involved with some of them guys and Fawny Willis was, you know, his lawyer. Okay, can't fully clout chase, but you still, it's like, even with that situation, it was like he was upset he was the only one not indicted on the case. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, cool. That's how we really got introduced to wide sale Mondo. Then now we can't get this nigga to shut up. It's like, bro, when he dropped the ain't no mystery in my history type shit, we was fucking with it. You dropped some music, the music didn't stick. Academics was fucking with you. He one of the biggest bloggers in the world right now. He was fucking with you. If he posted you and you was going viral on social media here, there, all the blogs covering you. Bro, that shit ain't work, bro. Everybody was telling you during that time to drop some music. He didn't drop no music. 
calling a spade a spade, man. He didn't got into it with Woody. Upset Woody doing 20 V1s and getting money off interviews and bitches want to fuck him and suck his dick. He was a little jealous of that. I ain't going to lie. I've been watching it and I've been covering it. That was jealous, bro. It's like, I get it, though. I'm a street nigga here, Rack. Real should be winning. Fake shouldn't be winning. But it's like, bro, you doing fake shit, too, at this point. Because it's like, Mondo, you got real people that's fucking with you, but you don't know. Now you going out sad doing lame shit. Like, this this situation was lame, bro. This shit was clout chasing. You feel me? He went from thug trial with Gunner. Then he went to Woody. Now he going from Woody to off. It's like, bro, he's looking for his way in the door. You know what I mean? And it's sad because he clout chased off Young Thug. We wouldn't really know of this guy if it wasn't for Young Thug. And now we just supposed to accept you. Same thing as Woody, though. I look at it like everybody do ride Woody Coattail now, but he don't have a talent. He wasn't. We don't know him from his music, or we know him from negative shit. We know Armando from negative shit and talking too much. We don't know him for his talent, his music, for him being thug right hand man. Woody say the man got caught stealing clothes and thug stop fucking with him. Then they saying Woody told. So it's like it's all fucked up. Then this nigga, she, you got the man ex-girlfriend coming out. She saying the same thing I'm saying. Man, y'all, this nigga broke. I ain't saying he broke, but she like, y'all, this nigga broke. Somebody get his nigga a job. He really clout chasing right now. He clout chasing off anything. That man ain't want to buy me a $1,500 purse. He had to. Hey, man. I like Mondo. Say, hey, man. She's saying you cheap. She's saying you broke and don't got nothing going on for yourself. And you just trying to involve yourself in the antics to go up and get some clout. And it's just like, hey. That shit lame, bro. That shit lame. I'm just a messenger. I'm just a nigga with an opinion. That won't play up. Like, nigga called to talk about they super P and this P this and P that and P that. Man, you didn't put that man name all in your mouth. See, then, this how you know it was a clout chase. Then he go start talk about how the nigga offset allegedly got robbed in his hood. Why we needed to know that if you was talking about Offset and Cardi? You went from that to then you had to turn it into it. Now you a street nigga. But then a week ago, two weeks ago, you were saying, you're on the sidewalk. So I thought you was on the sidewalk, Mondo. So Mondo was in the streets, jumped on the sidewalk. Now he back in the streets. Now he's su- This shit confusing. It's like, bro, you confusing. It's mystery in your history right now, Mondo. Then when your baby, when when your ex, she come out and start exposing you. Now you like you trolling. We finna troll you right into a bag, bro. The internet, uh, we familiar with the internet. Like, yes, you going viral. Yes, you hitting the blogs, but it's for being corny right now. That ain't good publicity. Like, it ain't for. Oh, we think he fly. Oh, his song hard. Oh, he's speaking some real shit about Thug. Oh, he's speaking real. It's like, bro, you just talking. It's mystery in that history. You know what I mean? And it's like, you stand on business and then you apologize for standing on business. It's like, damn, we don't know which side you working. Is you a real one and a street guy? A real street guy that we can fuck with? Or are you an internet clout chasing corny clone? Clown. We confused, Mondo. And it's like, I like what you got going on. You know what I mean? It's like you got a lot of potential to you. It's like, drop some music. Take over Atlanta. We know who Mondo is now. Give us a reason to... Say, oh yeah, why he been down with YSL. Now we see him in the video. He in a loaded video. He in a... A couple older videos. I was actually seeing Mondo in some older videos. So he was really around. But hey, man. It's looking like them people. They ain't rocking with you, Mondo. Time for you to kickstart your career in a different way. Not by clout chasing off another man's name. And just talking about people. It's like. 
don't do that. If you really known too, like you say, and 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 Atlanta is knowing you, I don't know. Would they support that? Like you just clout chasing off? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just a messenger. Y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Mono trying to start his rap career and get get everybody on his coattail to start just fucking with him instead of all these uh niggas and. I mean, hey, I salute it. He, if he know how to work the internet, if this is his way of working the internet to troll his way into a bag, like he say, cool. But it's just some real ones that's looking at this like, bro, you corny as fuck for that. And that's not player. Then when you, your ex come out and try to expose that you're not player, now you just trolling. Which one is it, Mondo? We confused. Is your P or you're not P? You got mystery in your history. You got money like you saying you got money? We confused, Mondo. Help us get help us understand what the hell your campaign is and what you doing and anyway, chat.